Hey guys, I'm Max Rowan and today I'll be teaching you guys the most overlooked aspect in making videos. Well, that my voice is cracked. Hey guys, I'm Max Rowan and today I'll be teaching you guys the most overlooked aspect in making videos and that has to be watermarks. Now the reason why you do want a watermark is simply because let's say someone stole your video. Now even if they did steal your video, you will know it's your video and you literally got nothing to lose. And another reason could be let's say you want to brand your videos more properly and more professionally. So with that being said, let's get started. Alright, so the first thing you have to do is go to file and click new. Alright, so let's say you upload your videos in 720p. So if you upload your videos in 720p, make the width 1280 by 720 and make sure this is pixels. And let's say you upload your videos in 1080p, make sure that this is 1920 by 1080p. So after that, make sure the background content is set to transparent. And after that, just click OK. And then you're going to get this canvas to work with. So the first thing you have to do is have a font, all right? So you don't want these normal basic fonts, all right? So the first thing you do have to do is go to Google and just go to thefont.com. And trust me, this website is amazing for fonts and you can literally get any font out there. So let's say you want a retro type of a font. So as, okay, American Captain is a great font. So I'm gonna download that right now download and then just click on the zip file all right okay okay yeah the noti notification always comes up i don't even know why okay yeah after that one type font okay yeah so just click one type or the other one and then just click install and then yes replace it because i already have it all right so okay then just click x and then just click x and then just go back to photoshop and after that just highlight a place and then just write your channel's name but make sure your font is set to american captain i've already done that so i'm gonna write extroid right now okay so i can barely see it but just move it to the top left you need to make sure it's either on the top left or the top right maybe even the bottom you can experiment in my eyes the left side is more effective in terms of placing your watermark so yeah i'm gonna place it right over here and then after that just go to the layer and then just right click go to blending options and then just click on the stroke all right and then let's see the size okay let's play with the size five uh four four looks good four looks good okay i'll leave it at four um the color you can really change it you can make it whatever color you want but i'm gonna make it as black and then after that i'm gonna do is go gradient overlay and then after that i can just choose any gradient i want now i can also edit the gradient just double click on it so now i can just double click over here and you can edit it and make your own color so i'm gonna make it green like my channel and i'm also gonna copy the code of the color so i'm just gonna copy that and then just do the same over here okay and change this to let's say like a dark darker shade or a lighter shade let me see what looks good um that looks good so i'm just gonna click okay okay you can play around and experiment with these tools over here you can edit with it but i suggest just keeping your watermark simple not making it all fancy because you just want it to be there and not really distract the viewer from watching your video so you know if you do make it all fancy the viewer will end up watching the watermark rather than the video so after that as you can see it looks all simple so now after that what you have to do is just go to the opacity over here and then just make it let's say um 60 percent now make it like 68 Okay, wait, uh, 70, 70, 75. All right, so 75 looks good. So now I'm gonna go to file and then just save this as watermark. All right, let's save it over here. Now I'll name it watermark. Now you have to save this file as a PNG. So I'm gonna do that right now. So save. So after that, go to your editing software and go to file and then click import and then click the import and then find your watermark. So I'm just gonna go quick access and then just do this quickly over here, watermark. And now I'm gonna add in the gameplay and show you how this actually works. So I'm gonna add an insert new video track and then just put this on top of my video track. So as you can see, 
it actually does look all right all right so let's say you want to lower down the opacity even more so just go to the video track over here and then just go to the middle and then you'll see opacity is 100 percent so just lower it down to your liking so that looks good so yeah guys that's how you make a watermark and insert it in your video guys if you did like the video please give it a big thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed already guys please subscribe and as always thanks for watching